Hello my audience, today Truth Detective is here in the room and we are going to be doing some voice practice and some voice coaching lessons for you. Ah! Perfect. And we are going to be talking about the human voice and how you will start to sound like you're not a boy anymore. Let's start with a man that sits in the forest and he's just drawing there, you know, trees. This took like 10 hours, you know, this drawing. I mean, 10 hours. And he's just sitting there and there comes around a reindeer. And the reindeer just starts to, you know, scream at him in black metal style. You're never going to become rich if you draw freaking trees for days! You know, that won't get you to the top anyways. And the man be saying just like, Oh really? I won't become rich if I draw freaking trees for days. Like man, I have to become a singer then. And he tries to sing in all kinds of ways, you know. This is probably your story. You try to sing like this. My lover, I have tried so very hard this style And to give you gifts and be so nice But every time you just say that that's all lies So I just freaking took my freaking battle axe And went to the hell realms and came back with this stuff so magic is in the man, in you and in all of us. And we have to bring it out now. I want to tell you the basics of the human voice. Let's do a little crouch or squat over here. Just like that. And let's lower our voice a bit. Hey, my man, you sound like a fucking sissy man. Add some magic in the back. Yeah, okay. So, the low ground is what you build upon. We can do very basic practice of just starting low, giving it a bit more power, and then you hear that more tension in the back. Great. That's the starting ground at the basics of the human voice. It starts low and then you build up from that and all of a sudden you end up with something like this. I started low, then I went and gave it more power yeah okay now I'm going to do you one really interesting voice over here we are going to depict a forest with our voice oh Oh, 
kind of like the root bark, you know, it has some texture to it. And then you elaborate on that and you throw in a couple of words. Oh, dog, no. You understand that the secret of the metal voice is that your vocal cords are being rattled like a rattlesnake. You are pushing air up from here, from your chest, and there's this pattern in your throat that cuts the air. And it makes it sound like that. It makes it sound like that because I push the air up from my lungs. And when it travels to the air above, it gives it this kind of character. Do you understand? It's not about what is fully happening over here. That's the problem with your metal singing, man. You are hurting your vocal cords. But really, if you learn to do this right, you can do it all day. I can guarantee you that if you learn to do this right, you can do this all day, my man. Yeah. So now, let's try. And do the punk voice again. And I'm going to explain to you a little bit more about how to add push and tension to the voice to make it sound more comical, you know. Let's start with the tension. So, let's start with the tension. Do you understand me over here? When I increase the tension around my chest area, over here, it brings the decibels of the voice kind of higher. It sounds a bit higher than before. But at the same time, it becomes more powerful. And if you talk or if you sing uh, with certain pauses between the words, it becomes very fulfilling and it fills up the room. And now the scene. If we really want to bring out your voice, we have to use your vocal cords. A really nice choice that you could make in this, in this moment is to buy a microphone that could represent what you are trying to fucking do. But really, man. Now. Let's cool down a bit and let's try that again. If I really want to tell you all about the human voice, it's that you want to become like the king of the world that sounds so powerful, you could be here from the other side of the planet. You get it. There's a lot of tension, you know, over here. There's a lot of tension over here, there's a lot of tension everywhere and you are kind of pushing the voice uh, but it's not really so much about, you know, the air, you know, that is being pushed from the lungs. It's more about, you know, controlling that push, kind of like constriction, you know. So, what is the opposite of constriction or contraction? It's relaxation or looseness. So, like this. When I really want to tell you that you have to be really loose in this moment to understand me, man. There's no other way that you can go. If you want to reach the top, you have to say just hello. 
Really, my man, if you really want to go and become the loosest guy, not the biggest loser you know. In this whole freaking world, you have to be really loose. Just focus on my face. This camera is no good. <laughs> like that. Just relax. No be tension, man. Just be hitting bunks and your J-Soul Nightmare Man. Okay, you understand with those kind of things anybody could do those kind of Yeah! Well that you couldn't probably do, but anybody could do those kind of things, you know. But the problem with most human beings is that when they use their voice, all of their voice comes from here, you know. It's like they don't have a body at all. And you want to learn to sing maybe. Uh, maybe in a style like this, then you have to unlock those powers within your body. You want to learn to sing in this kind of way, man. You have to understand that it comes from the chest area. And you want to get all kinds of rhythms, man. And all kinds of uphills and downs in your vocal cords And you will be hitting the trends You will become the best men in the whole world Not be like sounding like zizis anymore You sound like a fucking zizi Again If you want to be sounding like the best men in the history of mankind This is the trend And this is the way that you will have to walk in your life Just get out with pair of boots and your fedor eyes <sighs> Something like that So you understand that You sometimes have to exaggerate And go to the extremes of the human voice to bring those lessons about and so many people are so caught up in just you know one style of anything and they are caught up in this idea that I have to be you know for example a rapper you know I have to become a rapper there's no other way for me I have to be throwing lines about eating cheese and drinking coca-colas Maybe Mountain Dews. I have to be the guy that says no to the sugar rooms. Do you understand? They get all caught up in that. I have to be the guy that unlocks your mind. I have to be that dude that tells to you pretty straight that there's a Another way and another style for you. Don't be comma rapper. Rappers are all fools. Rappers are all fools. Don't become one of those. You want to reach the stars, you're gonna sing medals. Something like that. If you want to become a star, you're going to be singing black men dolls in the rapping fucking way. Okay, that's a challenge for you. Can you rap in black metal voice? If you want to become a cool rapper and you know. Okay, if you want to become the coolest rapper in the world, think about the rapper that did it in the style of the black metal. And you go into. You have your freaking guns. I have my guitar Russ. I'm the black metal rapper. And I'm have the stuff. Something like that. I'm the black metal rapper. And I have the stuff. I'm going to the top with my tummy guns. Okay. You get it. Like, usually we associate one style of doing things with certain rhythms. And when you break that apart, like, really think about it. It's usually not done, but it's possible. Yeah. So, 
For example, this painting over here. Let's look at it a little bit more closely. There's all kinds of brush strokes over here. And you see the rhythm over there? Or in this one, there's also a rhythm. And well, in each one of my paintings, there's, there's a kind of a rhythm. But well, these older ones are probably the best examples. But we associate uh, specific rhythm patterns with specific types of music. For example, with the jazz music, it's usually pretty loose, imp improvisational, that kind of stuff. With the jazz music, we associate the loose rhythms. Okay, the loose rhythms, the loose rhythms. If you want, if you want to become a winner in this life, don't be the. If you want to become a winner in this life, don't be hanging out with the losers, man. Do 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 do. If you want to become a winner in this life, don't hang out with the losers, man. You don't be belonging in some loser freaking gang. <sighs> do you understand? If you want to win in this life, don't be hanging out with the losers, man. You don't belong in that loser freaking gang. If you want to become the best man in your block, don't be hanging out with those losers, man, in their loser freaking gang. Do you understand? Do you understand? If you want to become the best man in this whole world, don't be hanging out with the losers, man. If you want to win big, then don't be hanging out with those losers, man, in the loser gangs. Loser gangs. Yeah. <coughs> Hit the subscribe buttons. I'm trying to map it out for you, the territory. So, next we are going back to that talking with your love voice. <sighs> I tried so very hard to say to you, my lover, that this world is so not cut out for me and you know, I tried to make big bucks I tried to drive the Ferraris I tried to become the rap star But I didn't succeed, man <laughs> And then there comes around some nigger dude And he says that I became the rap star But become the... I became the rap star But becoming the best I tried every style It was such a freaking test and when I got on this stage to do you stand up comedy in the rhythm way, it was the hardest stuff that you could ever do. You can be following me. You can join my gang. It's that. You know, sometimes my mind, it just freezes up when I try to rhyme. Sometimes my mind, sometimes my mind just freezes up when I try to rhyme. Sometimes my mind just freezes up. Sometimes my mind just freezes up when I try to rhyme. Let's change the color over here. You can change this color, you know, this light. Look at that. What we're gonna choose? We can click over here, like this, and then we go to go like green. Let's go to green. Okay, let's green. Let's go to green, 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 green. Okay. You know this psychedelic type of guitar sound that some bands have, usually in the dooms, doom, metal. You could sing to that like, 
When I feel that you belong in that gang I'm just gonna say my man that it all has to match and I'm gonna say to you, man, that we are progressing into the metal style slowly. Turn it back, my man. Swing, swing, swords, battle axe. Slowly we are coming up with the tracks And you see the warriors from the mountain tops Okay And you see the warriors from the mountain tops Shooting at the herd and the sheep with the arrows poisoned indeed slowly we come up with the lyrics for the song no be needing to hurry up riding horses so black yeah, something like that. <laughs> yeah! That's like take your shit. Diarrhea! <coughs> That's one of the problems with any kind of voice that you use your throat, con constricting your throat. You start to cough, but just go through it. Because when you do it, um, you learn to make those minor, adjust mi minor adjustments. They are very minuscule changes that you have to make to, for, first of all, make your voice sound better. But don't focus on that. Just focus on not coughing, not cracking up the voice and you will become golden. So, the cracking up of the voice, it doesn't usually come around as a problem in the metal style. Maybe that's so many guys want to sing metal nowadays. It's that you can't really hear those kind of, you know, things that would come about if you tried, for example, just, you know, the low frequencies. It's funny, but when you do the low frequencies, the problem is usually that you start to crack your voice. When I try the low frequencies, the problem over here is that the voice sometimes starts to crack. But I'm going to say to you, my man, that if you really want to sound like a mafia man, you have to learn this stuff first. Just learn to talk really low, and then you will be able to sing black meadows. Learn to talk really low, First, you master your vocal cords. You have to be able to do this kind of voice if you are a man. And you have to be able to do it without cracking up the voice at all, man. Okay, that's hard. But when you add to that, that you would have to rap in that voice, I'm going to try it, but it's going to be very hard. I'm going, I'm going to be saying to that. I'm going to be saying to you that you want to rap. And you don't want to get caught by the cops. You have to change your voice, man. And this voice is pretty, pretty low. You want to develop this. You have to freestyle, you know. No be writing lines, no be cigarettes, no be drinking sprites, no be popping any Zanikes, no be wearing Nikes, no be that stuff just wear the Fedora. You understand? It's all about the fucking Fedora. <clears throat> 
And when you do this kind of extreme practices, you sometimes you get pains in weird places on your body, your che your chest area, maybe your sides, maybe your you know like over here, you know, in the jaws. Uh, just learn what are the kind of the limits of your own kind of being and learn to play inside of those and yeah, just master this stuff. It's great. So the next thing that I'm probably going to do over here is start to sound like a hillbilly. And we are going to see that when something is funny, I mean, when something is funny, do you think that's funny? That's not funny. Don't be bullying me. Don't be bullying me. That's not funny. That's not funny. Understand? You, you say that I sound like a sissy. That's not funny. That's not funny. I'm gonna become a metal singer. You know? I'm gonna become a metal singer. That's not fun. So, heal a Billy. My Billy boy. My Billy boy. Hey Billy, what have you been up to lately? Okay, that doesn't sound like a heal Billy, but it's interesting. Let's go with it. My Billy boy, what have you been up to lately? Have you been? Billy boy, what have you been up to lately? How are you doing at school? Have you been getting any girlfriends? You sound like a sissy. <laughs> you sound like a zizi. Like a zizi. You sound like a zizi. I have to make you sound like you're busy. You sound like you're so busy. Don't be being that kind of zizi. That rhymes, you know. You're just a busy zizi. And your name is freaking Lizzie. <laughs> You're just a busy Zizi. And your name is freaking Lizzie. Be hitting the likes and the sub subscribes. <laughs> Fuck man. Now over here. Again. Let's do that. Scream and let's try to make it so that it's just something that only I can do. Yeah! Okay. Mommy, that's great. Yeah, that's something anybody can do. But you know that previous one, you know, nobody can do that. That's what you want in your voice. You want to learn to do stuff that nobody else can do. That will be your secret. But now let's go back and take all of this and let's return to the world of the human beings. So how are we going to talk to like real human beings? We're going to talk like this. It's very nice to be meeting you. How has your day been really today? And have you been learning any stuff about your voice lately? Have you been practicing? I bet you have. I bet that inside of you there's a metal singer man. Something like that. You hear that it's very soft and it's very smooth and it's kind of like, oh yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, let's get hot and dirty, you know. <laughs> you know, you can you can do all kinds of stuff, but some things are pretty out of the limit that you can do with other people. And that's the problem with this stuff is that you can really use these skills in most of human life. But if you distill the lessons of here, uh, you can apply them in your in normal interactions, and people are gonna hear it that you're. A little different kind of man when you talk like this little girl. It was very nice to be meeting you today. <laughs> I hope that we will be getting late pretty soon. <laughs> late pretty soon. <laughs> that kind of stuff. Yeah, 